I saved the best for last. I remembered from yeah, my did. playthrough before that uh, the shrine to go to is the one on the east side of the Great Plateau. The I'm going to butcher this. The Rota Shiga Shrine. <laughs> this this is <laughs> awesome. I think that this is probably the best shrine in the Champions Ballad. It's so fun. There's spikes coming at you everywhere. You need to build walkways to get across. Um, you're running down hallways where like spikes are chasing you. It feels very Indiana Jones. You need to paraglide through like all these obstacles coming at you and, and navigate your way around them. I thought that this one was so fun. Um, I agree that it was super fun. It is definitely the most creative, but it was also for me personally, and I feel like for some people... I think we were playing this at one of the uh, marathons and people were getting super frustrated with it, but it was the most frustrating because you're like, okay, I got past that last part and then you just die because you accidentally got hit by a swinging spike boulder. Oh. Or, <laughs> or, you know, it, it was like there was just so there was so much going on that it was crazy and you were super excited to make it past the last part that you died in the next part. Um, I personally died so many times on this shine and I was – uh, it was, again, frustrating in a fun way because I was just like, oh, gosh, dang it. Like, I just want to get through, but also this shrine is awesome. The uh, the paragliding parts in particular are, like, super stressful because there's, there's the yeah. three spikes that are hanging and they're going. Yeah. And so, like, what I did was I, um, I used stasis on, I think it was the second one. So I, like, I just got past the, the first one. I, I timed it right. The second one was still in stasis, so I got past that. And then I got past, and I was like, oh my god, I'm going to hit the third one. I'm going to hit the third one. And it, like, it missed me <laughs> by a whisker. It was so close. That was, like, that was such a rush. I think that this shrine is, like, really, really one of the ones that I remember about, like, Breath of the Wild as a whole. It's it's so intense. It's so fun. I really love, like, the Indiana Jones-style gimmick where, like, you you have that to be part, you yeah. have to be moving because there's a thing coming behind you and the platform has like all this different stuff going on and it's a narrow kind of platform and you could you know you can either fall or you can get hit by spikes. Um, this one was like really really fun. Uh, 